so this is Gabby from North Head Mitsubishi. I hope you're doing well, enjoying your day so far. I saw you inquired on our stunning 2020 Mitsubishi Outlander EXL, and so I wanted to come out here and do a quick walk around video for you here. That way you can get a feel for all the amazing features that come in this stunning vehicle. First things first, underneath the hood, we are gonna have a 2.4 liter four cylinder engine. Um, so this here, obviously for a seven seater SUV, that means it's gonna be super, super fuel efficient, especially for a seven seater. It's not gonna be a V6 taking all your gas here. As you can see as well, we do have our daytime running headlamps, which are LEDs. And then underneath you are gonna have your fog lights for extra light exposure. I'll give you a nice quick look of our, our tires here, which are 18 inch alloy wheels with your all season tires on them from our previous owner. And then a nice quick look of the body style here. It's the older body style, but honestly, I find it super beautiful. Our previous owner kept it in amazing condition and I actually took in this vehicle here really only has about 40 something kilometers like it's an amazing condition he barely drove it and he's bought he's bought from us about three times serviced here it's a very well maintained vehicle as you can see you are going to have your power side folding mirrors as well this come does come with your turn signal integrated lamp you're also going to get your blind spot warning and it does also come with the 360 camera so as you can see you have four cameras one of them is here you are going to have one in the front one for the side on each side and then you're going to have the backup camera as well Taking a look to the back here, we're gonna open up the trunk, take a look at the amazing cargo space back here. Okay, so again, the Outlander is gonna be a seven passenger vehicle. So this is the vehicle with all of the seven seats up. Now I'll give you a configuration with some seats down. That way you can take a look at the amazing cargo space this vehicle can utilize. Okay, and again, I just folded down the third row seat. So now we have a ton of more cargo space back here. Let me put on my flap. Hopefully that's a lot better. Um, and then you can actually even fold down the second row seat. So let me give you an example of that here. Again, EXL, we're gonna get our premium leather seats here. You do also have a sunroof up there. And then we have some nice liners down here from the previous owner again. So if you want to fold down the second row seat, we're gonna do the second lever here. It's gonna actually pop open for you. This one, it's number one, so you should already have it down, which I do. And then this lever here just folds down. That actually gives you a 50-50 split. So you get a 50-50 full for the second row and the third row. So take a look at that amazing cargo space you just utilized there. And again, really depends on who's, who you're putting in the vehicle. Maybe you only have one child, maybe you're gonna have a couple, but you can utilize the space in many, many different ways. Now we're gonna take a look at the front for further features. We are also gonna have our keyless entry, which the car is already open, so I'm not gonna test that out, but keep up just needs to be on your person here. Again, you're gonna have your premium leather seats. You're gonna have power driver side seating as well. Taking a look here again, we only have about 45, when the vehicle shuts off, 43, 43,504 kilometers. It is an amazing condition. I'm gonna put this vehicle back. When okay, and lots of lots of options in our EXL here. First of all, we are gonna have our heated steering wheel, so that's super awesome, especially for Canadian winters. Heated steering wheel button's just gonna be on the side here. You do also have a blind spot button here if you wanted to turn it off. I personally like it, so I'm gonna keep that on for me, and it's just gonna show me on my driver dash display here. Moving on to the left here, we are gonna have some safety features. This one here will be your forward collision mitigation. So we're gonna have three settings for that, far, middle, and near. I always recommend far, because it gives you the most reaction time with the next, or the vehicle in front of you. So say, for example, this vehicle is in front of me, they come to a sudden stop, my vehicle will warn me to brake up here on the driver dash. If I don't brake in time, it's gonna try and brake for me. It's gonna try and prevent a collision. So that's why I recommend putting it in the far setting and that way you have more reaction time to actually brake. This here's your lane departure warning. So that is on now, you can turn it off and that goes hand in hand with your blind spot warning. So if you're maybe drifting out of your lane or it's not, you're not in the correct lane, you're about to merge and maybe someone's there, it's gonna continue to warn you. You also have a ton of options here. Bluetooth, Bluetooth interface on the left hand side. You also have this cup here. So it's a very strange button. People wonder what it is. It's actually for your multi-view camera system. So that, as you can see, you get your 360 camera, bird's eye view, even the side camera for your side mirror, if you wanted to have a look at that. And then you are gonna have cruise control as well as adaptive cruise control. So that's an also an, an awesome feature here. We currently have our dual zone climate control, which is synced at the moment. You can unsync it if you didn't want it synced, and then you guys can have different temperatures for the passenger and driver seat. Um, and then moving on, you get Sirius XM radio. We have AM FM radio. You're gonna be able to connect with Android Auto or Apple CarPlay. Many, many options down here. Again, so a little more buttons, some USB. You also have car charger if you need it, eco mode. 
and then moving down here we have our super all-wheel control system so as you can see we have all-wheel control eco I'm going to turn that on again. You just press the button to see which ones you have. Normal mode, snow, gravel, and again, all-wheel control eco mode. And you can put any of them in eco mode with this button here. But if you are driving, you can actually change the, the drive mode you like to be in anytime. And then heated front seats, electric parking brake, and auto hold. So this, again, is just a very quick video on our stunning 2020 EXL. Thank you so much for joining me today. I really appreciate it.